Hey everyone, it's Friday the 23rd of June and it's 7.35 in the evening. As you can tell, for a change, I'm actually holding the camera. Now there's two reasons for that. I need it off the tripod because I'm taking the camera to Mum's tomorrow. Um, I'm dog sitting because they they're um, going out to a wedding. They've been invited to a wedding. Um, and I've got a lot to do in the man cave as well. So I thought I'll take the camera and I can um, show you what I've been up to and whatnot and what the future plans are. Also, I've got a new uh, member of my little family here. I've got a new kitten. So, there's Smudgy over there. Ignore all the cars, I'm in the process of, um, you know, reorganising everything. So I'd like you all to meet Snowy. Now both Snowy and Smudge have the same parents. Apparently these had the same father as uh, the last litter of kittens. So um, my brother and his girlfriend, their cat had kittens again. And when he was here last uh, Sunday, he was talking about the kittens and he said, you know, he's seems to be having quite a bit of trouble getting rid of them unless like nobody wants them they arrange to come and view them and never turn up so he asked if I wanted one he said you know at least I'd know it's going to a good home because that's where he came from <laughs> um, so it must have took me about two minutes to think about it I'm not kidding and I said yeah I'll take another one now this one is definitely a girl <laughs> I've checked checked and double checked under there um, as you can see, she's settled in very nicely over the last three days. Um, and Smudgy over there loves her to bits. He was actually giving her a wash earlier. I'm not going to show you behind me because it's where the litter trays are, so it's not very pleasant. <laughs> but I did buy a second litter tray. I thought two might be a better idea. She's just gone in the covered one. <clears throat> but yeah, she's actually using the trays fine, just like Smudge did. She's eating her food fine, she's drinking, she's charging about the flat like a lunatic. So is Smudge when they're playing. They literally they love to play together. I cannot believe how well Smudge has actually taken to her. You know, I was worried in the beginning that he might get a bit territorial and you know, this is his home and cats are known to be quite territorial but uh, no he's quite enjoying her now I'm topless because it's bloody hot in this flat in fact it feels cooler at this end of the lounge than it does up by the computer I might just sit here for the rest of the evening um, I've just found a car on the floor that was meant to go to mum's today because uh, me and my stepdad came over here in the van and loaded it up with a literally a van full of stuff. Stuff for the man cave and stuff for the yard sale, which I'll talk more about tomorrow as well. Um, <clears throat> we're doing a yard sale on the 2nd of July over at Mum's. Village-wide one. It's a village event that uh, Buxton has once a year and all the proceeds um, that are collected, because you can pay to have your house put on the map which is six pounds then I think they sell the maps for like a pound and all those proceeds they go to various charities apparently I'm guessing they just split it all um, 10 till 2 is the uh, official opening times but I guess it's whenever you want to just get your garden ready and whenever you get fed up <laughs> That's the way I see it anyway, whenever you just, you've just you had enough for the day and you just want to pack it all up. Yeah, but I'll talk more about that tomorrow because there is a load of stuff stacked in my man cave at the moment to go on this yard sale. It's actually getting in the way. <laughs> it's taking up, it's taking up um, real estate that I want to use. <clears throat> but uh, yeah. I've now got two lovable fluff balls. You know. I actually folded that bath towel up and put it on the floor for something, you know, soft fur to lay on. There's even a pillow in the hallway 
where she likes to lay and she's ignored both of those and done exactly what Smudge did when I brought him home and sleeps under there. <laughs> or I have actually found her asleep beside the towel on the floor and I'm just like, why? Why don't you just sleep on the towel? She's just jumping about here. Smudge is down beside but I really need to get the vacuum cleaner up this end. I'm guessing it was her that thought that was a good idea to shovel half the uh, litter tray out onto the floor. So in future I'm not going to put so much litter in it. Could you stop chewing my wires? You know, that's brand new. I've not even used this yet. It's another uh, rotary tool, you know, with a little clamp thing for it. And it's got the flexi bit as well. Section of bits, man, we've got the stand, which I just realised is up there. I did wonder where that was. I'm guessing that's what all of these are for as well. Ooh, something. It'll, be all, it'll all be in the manual. We'll have to RTFM later. Got it at Lidl's. I do like Parkside stuff. It is reasonably good for the price. <clears throat> Some people might see it as just cheap crap, but... I've not had any problems with Parkside stuff. At the end of the day, it's just rebranded oldie stuff. It's exactly the same stuff with a different name stuck on it. Slightly different box design. <laughs> All she wants to do is literally play 24-7. I mean, I was woken up at uh, 5.30... No, 5. In the morning. Yesterday morning. Which actually didn't bother me because I'd actually fallen asleep at 9pm. Literally, I'd just gone into the bedroom because I was hot, so I thought I'd lay on the bed under the fans for a little bit and I dozed off. Woke up at half past midnight. So by, you know, by the time I woke up again at sort of 5am, I thought, yeah, I've had about eight hours sleep, that's enough. So I got up. <laughs> The other three kittens, she had another litter of four. She had, this mother cat had um, four kittens um, previously when I got smudge. But this time she had three white cats like this one. And all three of them had the grey patch on the head. You don't need to get in your food dish. She eats out of either food. I'll just chuck food in each dish now and just let these two share. They don't even fight. Smudge actually lets her eat first. When she's done eating, she comes along and well, he comes along and eat. Um, there was a grey one. But when I got to my brothers and uh, they were trying to round up the cats, you know, or the kittens, I should say, ready for me to pick, although I got chosen. Um, her daughter came down the stairs, grabbed the grey one, and disappeared upstairs again. <laughs> Well, that one is pretty much spoke before, and I knew that beforehand, so... I don't think I would have chosen that one anyway. Like I said, this little munchkin chose me. <clears throat> no, we were sitting there, my brother said, which one do you want then? And I'd said, well, I think I've just been chosen. <laughs> Do you know, there's that much litter mess on this floor, I think I should give you two the bloody vacuum cleaner. Look at it! As fast as I hoover it up, it just turns into a white dot to dot again. I could probably draw a picture with a black marker on this floor at the minute. Anyway, I just want to do a quick little video to introduce the new munchkin. She's settled in really, really well. She hasn't figured out how to get on my bed yet. <laughs> she can get on the sofas though, so I'm not going to give it long. <laughs> she is so gentle with her paws as well. When I do things like this, I'm going to try not to hit that record button again. Yeah, I'm going to do something like this. He's so gentle. Can we see the... There is the patch on the head. The grey patch on the heads, they're all different on each kitten. And bless her, when I first brought her home, she did a, 
did her business in an empty cardboard box, thankfully. Um, unless to say it wasn't solid business. But <laughs> and uh, I had to wipe her bottom, bless her. I felt like I was dealing with a baby. I suppose technically I am just a baby kitten. <laughs> what play with a car, do you? Can claim the car now? Can I not sell that at the yard sale? <laughs> Smudge, what are you trying to eat? She's literally just... Oh, I thought she was pouncing on nothing. It's Smudge's tail. She's got a thing for chasing his tail. <laughs> this seems not the case. Just letting her play with it. There's places he can go if he gets fed up with it. I did find him in the uh, sink in the bathroom the other morning when I woke up. Because <laughs> obviously little one can't get up there yet. She's not big enough. Bless her little furry paws. Come here. She's so full of energy. Seriously, she is buzzing around this place more than she is sleeping. I don't know where she's getting this energy from. You secretly sneaking some sugar from somewhere? You can't really pet her because all she wants to do is play. <laughs> she settled in a lot better than I thought she was going to do as well. I don't know, maybe I just doubted them both too much. Hmm? Did I? And Daddy doubt you? That was actually quite uh, spectacular when I came in today from Mum's. Smudge was in the hallway like he usually is, and when I got to the lounge door, she come running out from under the sofa to greet me. Didn't you? Should I call you Snowflake or Snowball? You cannot be hungry again. You're going to get fat. You can keep an eye on things. Just make sure Smudge is getting some food and that, you know, she isn't eating at all. I actually thought Smudge, you know, was going to be the jealous one. You know, especially if I started giving her a bit too much attention. Now, if anything, I'm the jealous one, because Smudge has barely given me any attention since I bought her home. He's just been interested in her and just playing with her. Where's he gone? Oh, he's gone through the other room now. So he must have got a bit fed up with... A bit hot and bothered. Although he did uh, jump up on the bed last night and give me some cuddles. I'll let you into a little secret as well. You know, a few days after I brought Smudge home, I'd already decided that I wanted another cat. <laughs> so when um, this happened, I only found out last week that uh, their cat had another litter of kittens. And I thought, I'm extremely tempted to ask for one. Mm. Pardon me. And I don't regret it. At all. Not one bit. Some people might think I'm mad, you know, in a top floor flat. And I know I've got a second kitty cat. I don't care. Call me the crazy cat man if you like. She doesn't really chase fingers, she just watches them. I don't know if you can hear that rustling. If you can, there's my fingers on the carpet. But, uh Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> 
I'm too used to the camera being on a tripod. I suck at freehand. I always sucked at freehand anyway. Don't worry, I've got tripods and things over at Mum's. I've got a couple of them actually. I've got a couple here. I've got another one in the um, cupboard if I needed to. You know, Smudge likes to sharpen his claws on my trainers and you just like to attack them. Right, now, do I get my backpack ready tonight or do I do that in the morning? Either way, I suppose I should shut this video down now. Get this footage onto the computer and get it edited together. Well, I say together, I do these videos in one long continuous shot. I don't cut anything together unless I have to stop the video for something, you know. I have to stop it to go and get something. Or if uh, nature calls, that's the other reason I'll pause the video and you'll get like a little jump cut. Other than that, for the most part, it is literally from start to finish one take. Even on the gaming channels channel rather it's actually easier to do on the gaming channel you just play the game you can pretty much just roll with it anywho thanks a lot for watching everyone if you like the video you know what to do give that like button a click of course if you didn't give the dislike button a click Well, of course, if you have any comments, questions, etc., then leave them down in the uh, comments section. I do read them all. I don't always reply because, quite frankly, I forget. I'm extremely forgetful. I'm getting quite worried because I seem to be getting worse at that, and that is worrying me. I haven't noticed it. I mean, like three or four days ago, my mum asked me to go into um, what we call the drugstore here. That is the actual name of the store, by the way. <laughs> but they sell it. You'd probably think it just sells, you know, over-the-counter medications and whatnot, but it doesn't. It has got them there, but it sells other things like toiletries, cleaners, etc. But she wanted me to get a couple of bits in there, and I totally forgot until she said about it today, and I was like, whoops. <laughs> and I'm such a hypocrite, because I'll moan at her for her poor memory as well. And here I am, forgetting things left, right and centre at the minute. Anyway, um, also, if you check the video description down below, there will be links to my gaming channel, my Lego channel, the Discord server, and my Twitch. If I remember, because I've only just started um, including the Twitch. But I do want to do some live streams. I did that last week, um, and actually quite enjoyed it. You know, I'll probably mostly just be playing games and just hanging out that way. I don't ever want to become a Twitch affiliate or anything like that. Just like I don't really want to make money off YouTube either. It seems like such a headache. You know, I follow so many other big YouTubers that make money from it. And it seems like a hell of a lot of effort for, well, to begin with, a little reward. You know... Unless you've got something ridiculous like over a million subscribers. Well, I say ridiculous, that's quite a um, feat really, isn't it, if you can get to that much. Anyway, I'm rambling, so thanks a lot for watching, everyone. That's better. Um, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.